A battle is shaping up today in Texas over a plant. We're talking about marijuana. A new survey finds more than 9 in 10 Texans want to decriminalize marijuana. And we had Jack Fink take a look at this today. All new at 6. You could call it a sign of the times. This is the first billboard put up by a North Texas group who support legalizing marijuana in the Lone Star State. Stores selling marijuana for recreational use have taken Colorado by storm. Now a confidential survey by the liberal group Progress Texas shows 92% say they support the same thing here. I mean, if you can tax it, make some revenue, and like, I mean, it seems like a pretty efficient thing, and we'll see, like, as time goes, like, how it keeps progressing. In the same survey, 93% in Texas say they support decriminalizing marijuana. While some favor decriminalizing marijuana, that doesn't mean they also favor legalizing the drug. Uh, I worry about that. I am Becca Kroll has run the Nexus Recovery Center for women for 24 years. Of the 2,000 they treat each year, she says as many as three of four started with marijuana. Over and over again, we hear the stories about people smoking pot and drinking, and before you know it, they're full-blown addicts. According to the survey, most people also support legalizing marijuana in Texas for medical purposes. UT Dallas professor Robert Morris just published the first of its kind study on states that legalize medical marijuana. That we found no increase in crime rates at the state level for states that pass laws legalizing marijuana for medical purposes. Most law enforcement groups strongly oppose legalizing marijuana for any purpose. Jack Fink, CBS 11 News.